Hello from California, this is Sandy from Messy Paper Crafts, your number one online store with the most exciting crafting items. And welcome to this week's episode of What's in the Box, but this time with no box because it's a really small release. And the reason why I wanted to show this to you is A, it's really adorable, so it's super cute, so you have to see this. However, I wasn't quite sure if I should put this company into Messy Paper Crafts because it's a little bit more expensive and I was curious to see why. So here we have the six by six premium quality paper. So obviously it's high standard paper, but the reason why it's more expensive and I didn't realize this, this is actually double the amount that you get usually in a paper pack. So if you look at Asuka or Stamperia or Shabella, they usually have a six by six paper pad that has about 20 or 24 sheets. And here you have 40 double-sided sheets. And this is why it's more expensive. So hopefully this answers your questions because I thought about this. I was really like, I'm not sure what's so special about this paper. Why is it a bit more pricey? And now you can see why you do get a lot of options here. And obviously it's super cute. So let's have a flip through it. So as you can see, it's really cool. It's like a kid's book. And you have all these adorable fussy cut elements. And then you can just tear these papers out and just cut them. And each of them is three, four, four times. Do I count this correct? One, two, three, four. Yeah, correctly. <laughs> so we have four times the design. And then here we have this really cute scenery. And then this gorgeous cute little snowman and these little gingerbread elements and then this on the other side here we have this beautiful layout like a collage and this side you get these little presents more presents and then here's this gorgeous paper i mean this is really thick and a little bit shiny so i believe they call this the pearlescence papers and with elegant effects. So it's definitely a very high quality paper. I love that. Yeah, it's kind of thicker here. You can, can almost feel the, feel the design. So yeah, really, really adorable. Here even more, Dif a little bit of a different color. Here we have this super cute, like collage element here. Really nice background, I love that. Then we have this color scheme. And again, this almost has like a shiny effect to it, if you can see this. This is probably what they say with this pearlescent, yeah, kind of like a coating, I would say. It feels really nice. Then we have this here. Different color scheme. And here's this cool blue. Yeah, tiny bit shiny, not too shiny here. Then this on the other side. And then one more area here for fussy cutting. I think this is so adorable. I love this here with the gingerbread people in the house, the snowman, this little guy here. And then, yeah, this is kind of like a book. <laughs> hence why it's a little bit more pricey but I have to say I really really enjoy having a paper pad that's like totally different to anything else and they have this really cool range here as well where they have these great accessories so if you love these elements here you also can have those as a stamp so it looks like stickers but it's actually a stamp set and it gives you the idea on it already how you could color that so for me, this is always really helpful because it's a bit of a guidance on how I can color in, for example, this little yeah, bear, polar bear, maybe, <laughs> or these little gingerbread men. So I think this is really, really fun. Then in the same line for Candy Christmas, you also get these little ephemera pieces here. So lots of gingerbread and the house. Let me open this as well. As I said, lots of these 
cute little gingerbread people. Like if you don't like stamping and coloring, then here it's already done for you. If you just need a quick element as a foreground for the paper. Here we have this really cute gingerbread man on a cake or might, might be gingerbread girl. <laughs> and I think this is so adorable. And this one here. And they are chipboard, so they're very sturdy. And then you can ink them even further if you wanted to or distress them. Here we have this one. Cute little gingerbread here in this dome, hand in hand. <laughs> I love this here, the train, gingerbread house. This is really cute. <laughs> and the bigger version of the house. So yeah, really cute little items here that can embellish your pro projects even further. A little Christmas decoration here. Then they also have washi tape. I hope you can see this. So with the same scenery that you just saw in this little booklet, you can also have this washi tape to do some decoration on your projects, like your scrapbooking or your cards. And if you love any kind of shaker cards, or maybe you just want little bits to decorate your item, like your scrapbooking and so on, then they also have these really cute sequins in their line. So they have these little snowflakes. I hope you can see how shiny they are. And then, yeah, kind of like holographic sequins and then silver whitish elements as well. So, I hope that you enjoyed seeing this for real and I hope it eases your mind a little bit that this is not like crazy expensive, that you actually get more here, like way more paper. And hopefully this inspires you for your Christmas project. And with that, have a crafty weekend and remember, no stressy, be messy and have fun. See you next time. <music>